These are the muscles of the axilla, the anterior wall. We have the pectoralis major. The origin is the anterior medial half of clavicle, right here. The anterior sternum. The um, upper six costal cartilages, which are right here, one, two, three, four, five, six. So from here up, and then this is the clap or the sternum. And then the aponderosis of the external oblique. So these are the external obliques. So you can see the aponderosis is that tissue over top of it. And then we have uh, its insertion, which is the lateral lip of the intertubercular sulcus of the humerus, which is right here. Lateral lip of intertubercular sulcus of humerus. And its function is uh, internal rotation, adduction, flexion, and horizontal adduction of the shoulder joint. And then we have pectoralis minor, which is right here. And its origin is the anterior surface of ribs three through five. So that's three through five is right here, anterior surface. And its insertion is the coracoid process of the scapula, which is this. And its function is scapular tipping, depression, protraction, and downward rotation. And then last we have the subclavius, which is right here. This is the subclavius. Its, ins or its origin is the first costal cartilage, which you can see right here. And its origin, or its insertion, is the inferior surface of middle one-third of clavicle. So you can see that right here. And its function is that it depresses and stabilizes the clavicle for glenohumeral movement.